Hey everyone, this is Robin Stewart coming to you from College Coach. Today we're going to tackle the question I think most parents love to hate, the one that asks, what can I be expected to contribute? Now, people take all different approaches with this question. Some people will say we've saved in a college-specific account. We're going to take that number and divide it by four and put that here on my profile. That's fine. Other people may try to come up with some percentage of their income based on what they can save and what they can get from their current income and what they can finance. That's fine, too. There's no wrong answer. We believe that if you truly can't afford something, to put zero, you're being honest. Other than that, it's a good idea to be conservative and report a value that's less than your calculated EFC. And if you haven't calculated your EFC yet or don't know what your EFC is, you should run a calculator. We'll provide a link in the comments to the one on the College Board website. And the reason being is at some schools, if this number is higher on the form, they may take that instead of the one that is calculated through the formula. So it's a good idea to be a little conservative when answering this question. That's all I have for today. Thanks for listening. And I'll see you next week when we talk about the treatment of untaxed income on the profile.